Now, your news on the go. Well, we begin on Oneida Lake where a desperate search to find a missing voter has reached a tragic end. Last night, the Oneida County Sheriff's Office confirming they found the body of 62-year-old David Brown of Oneida. The search began after deputies saw a small boat floating near the shoreline and discovered it was empty. Crews eventually found Brown's body in the water. The autopsy will determine the cause of death. Back in Syracuse, we're learning the name of the victim shot and killed Saturday night in Armory Square. Syracuse police tell us 25-year-old Ramal Kurse was shot several times on Clinton Street between the Corner Bar and the Gilded Club. According to the district attorney, the shooting was between two rival gangs. The migrant crisis making headlines again. Overnight, we've learned the state attorney general is looking into DocGo. That's the company hired by New York City to help migrants move to different parts of the state. At one point, it was hiring for a field operations manager in Syracuse. The Turning Stone is looking to fill hundreds of job openings today. It's hosting a hiring expo at the Turning Stone Event Center from 10 to 6. Registration is encouraged, but you can walk in. Well, you can walk into the fair tomorrow. The Great New York State Fair begins, and the interim fair director, Sean Hennessy, has now officially been formally given the job. He was technically hired as deputy director last year, but was acting as the interim after the sudden departure of the former director. And in just a few hours, we will find out what the butter sculpture will be. We'll stream the big reveal on localsyr.com.